What's up, YouTube? Today, we have another French knife. I got it from this guy. This is not paid promotion. I pay for all my knives because I am not a beggar, right? I don't beg. I don't eat beg. And I've never put up a Patreon um, or anything like that. Or, you know, a GoFundMe. Um, I'm just, you know, not if you have, that's fine. I'm just, I have not. Uh, this, this X75 the patina you can kind of see it it leans toward yellow it's actually pretty interesting so if i were to be the typical american right and i were to take this and really crank really like ah, yeah you can feel it flex this is how you check for see this this is how case does it and i agree with them if it doesn't do anything then there's not any wobble because honestly, unless I really, like right now, no no wobble, no wobble. If I crank on it, there's going to be some wobble. This has a half stop, one of the few French knives that does. I f believe this, it is because this knife uh, is I th intended, I think, very much for food. Um, it works great for that. Uh, I've, I've eaten quite a few things with it, actually. Cuts chicken like a champ. <laughs> Um, it's a great piece. Let's get, uh, some measurements cause it is a little bit bigger. Obviously this is horn. Um, so overall about eight and a half cutting, cutting blade about three and a half. But, uh, yeah, this is super, super dope piece. Got some bone or, uh, got some texture to that horn. As you can see, it's no slouch. This blade is uh, very nicely done. So yeah, if you're looking for a piece, I mean, this could be for anything, but I do believe it's for food. But if you're looking for a piece that a little bit larger um, and something that won't break the bank, this is the Pradel, and you should check it out. Maybe pick it up. Like, comment, subscribe, folks. Um, and that's all she wrote. Have a good rest of your day. Bye now.